All right, guys. Joining Mikey here today. You do like to go by Mikey, right? Yes, That's please. Yeah, okay. definitely. Yeah. Good deal. So joining Mikey here today. We tried to do this once before, and it kind of failed on us. Well, no, we did it, but oh, true. there was no audio. Uh, yeah. So, okay. Yeah. So I failed. The video was great, though. Was. The video was great. Probably. Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, we're here today at the PG Farmers Market. Mikey here owns. Um, he owns Nitro Cycle, mm -hmm. and let's see if we can get more of Mikey in the picture here. I'll just get closer. We'll just snuggle up here. Hey, what's the time? <laughs> <laughs> and uh, what is Nitro Cycle? Tell us a little bit about Nitro Cycle. Um, well, Nitro stands for nitrogen food grade gas, and that is the same kind of gas that's in like a Guinness beer or a stout. And uh, Cycle is a bicycle, so I, I serve nitro infused beverages off of a bicycle. I have a bicycle, and my camera is going all oh, over wow, the place. Oh wow, we're going! Hey, oh, hey, hey we did go. it! There we go. What's up, guys? So it's off of a bicycle. So yes. you cycle all over the place. Yo, yeah, I've never had my license, so I just kind of ride my bike everywhere. There you go. Good deal. So why did you decide to start this nitro-infused beverage service? I really like nitro coffee. Uh, mm -hmm. I got involved with that in 2017, like 13 around there. Okay. Um, I had another cart called the Off the Grid Smoothie Bike, okay. and we put a tap on that, and we were dispensing the apple juice for our smoothies and also nitro coffee. Okay. So I was, uh, we were like the first non-corporate nitro entity in Monterey's existence before uh, okay. Starbucks even had it on their taps. Good deal. I was very excited to do that. Cool. And, um, I just love the creamy texture. It just, it just elevates the taste on everything. So that's what it does mostly, right? It's yeah. Like, it's a texture. It's kind of a texture thing, and a, and a, you, you like the taste of it as well. Just a mouth texture change. Uh -huh. Yeah. It's it's not gonna like a lot of people think nitro stands for like speed you up, which is you know nitro like uh, the same kind of thing that you know uh, Vin Diesel you know uh -huh. pressing the button yep. kind of thing. Yep. So. Sure. Um, there's there's no button. There's there's no nitro <laughs> getting injected into your system. It's not like a car. You're not speeding up. Sure. Uh, the juice actually has no caffeine at all, but uh, it's still okay. nitro infused. Yeah. It's uh, an infusion, not a carbonation. So okay. it's uh, molecular like little tiny ass little bubbles, mm -hmm. and it's on a micron status. So it's okay. it's injecting super tiny bubbles into the liquid, and that's making it smooth and creamy and frothy, not carbonated and, and frizzy like a soda. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, so I love it. I think it's great. <laughs> Thanks, My daughters love it. And I, like, I saw the uh, line <laughs> going down the jar. <laughs> yep. No, it's good stuff for sure. Thank uh, you. Looks like you might have a oh, oh, hey, how's it going? Um, uh, anyway, so why? So that's why you decided to start it. Why did? Or, um, sorry, what surprised you most about owning this little cycle business here? Oh man, um, the city is no help. When in terms of uh, <laughs> permits and or telling what you need to do to get going, mm -hmm. uh, the health department helped out a lot. Surprisingly, they oh, were they were actually really That's nice. Good. Uh, the biggest hang up I think I've had was other businesses calling the police on me. That was fun uh, wow. when I first started. Yeah, they thought I was serving beer. I had a lot of people uh, thinking I was serving beer. Okay. Uh, which is understandable. It, it is a tap, so it does look like sure. beer. But sure. I do have a menu, so they could have read they before they the bothered menu. the yeah. officer's sure. time. But, you know, well, it's all good. For sure. Okay. <laughs> well, good deal. And Being all mobile on a bike has also been kind of a challenge, especially when the, the winter hit uh, during the pandemic. And... Uh, it was cold and there wasn't a lot of people around, so <laughs> it's good to have the, the new bike with the, the espresso machine and, and just kind of stepping out for my community, basically. Good deal. New, new bike, huh? So, yeah. So who, did you build it yourself or did someone? Yeah, we definitely built it off of a carcass of an ice cream bike. It was just, okay. it was like a sad excuse for a bike. There was no inner tubes, the, the, the back tire was flat, there was no brakes. The sink oh, yeah. didn't work. The frizz, the freezer that was installed was broken and busted, so we had to pay for that to actually get the <laughs> trash. Um, but yeah, we, we installed the sink system onto it, uh, full electric generator, so there's no gas, no propane at all. Oh wow! So okay, there's so it's, it's all, all electric. You. All yeah, electric all electric. All you. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we we, we cool. really want to make an effort to do uh, do away with the the fossil fuels. I don't want to be a fossil fool. <laughs> um, but um, okay. the, uh, there's no there's no um, propane gas anything. It's all electric. Cool. Yeah, man. Cool. I, I that's dig awesome. it. That's, uh, that's great. Yeah, I bicycle commuted to work for like two years. It's awesome. I, like I said, I've never had a license, <laughs> so it's it's definitely been one pedal at a time for me. Sure. Yeah. Sure. sure. Uh, that's cool. Well, good deal. Where can where can we find you? 
Uh, well, I'm, well, obviously I'm here every Monday. Uh, it's winter hours now, so we're down from 2 o'clock to, or excuse me, 3 o'clock till 6 p.m. now. Okay. But all the way, uh, usually it goes to like 7. Okay. Um, Thursday, farmer's market in uh, Pomo by the Sea. Okay. Tuesday, sometimes I'll crash the market, but they don't, again, the city is yeah, buttholes. So uh, I don't even want to deal with that anymore. So we're okay. teaming up with Savino's uh, wine bar again. We're going to do nitro okay. mimosas again. Okay, cool. So you can find us there, get a jar filled up of uh, your coffee and all that stuff too. Sure, cool, yeah. cool. All righty, uh, so it's... Mondays in Pacific Grove, mm -hmm. Thursdays in Carmel Valley, yep. and is it going to be Tuesdays at this? Savino's? Yeah, at Savino's, yeah. Savino's? And then okay. uh, festivals, events. The December 3rd, we're going to be doing the Night Marketplace okay. at the Art Park in San City. That's okay. going to be epic. Last last time it was nuts. So okay, cool. It's, it's a lot of good fun. Yeah. Find, yeah. find him on Instagram. What's your 831 Nitrocycle? Your Nitrocycle Instagram? 831. Ah, there we go. Hey, the almost, around. almost. Nitrocycle 831. If you find him on there, you'll he'll tell you where he's going to be yeah and... i usually post day of mm -hmm. uh morning of or night before okay yeah and then he also tells you about all these cool events that are going on so you just follow him around all the cool events you'll be set i you'll get your there's coffee, some cool you'll ones get your yeah. events. you'll be good there you go <laughs> <laughs> all right anything else we need to know uh that you're awesome that's about it yeah, yeah. thanks man i appreciate it <laughs> all right dude thanks for your time dude. thanks for joining us and have a good one later guys thanks Bye. for your